205 Horse Gym with Boots, Routine 9, using a fence as our focus. We start with walking along and then halting for up to 10 seconds. We can build up polite waiting at the halt, one second at a time, starting with whatever the horse is comfortable with. I'm just putting the rope over her because we're sort of working it toward liberty. Two is to ask the horse to back up to the end of the rope or up to ten steps. We did eight steps of back up there and I'm still going to her to deliver the treat and then backing off again. I want her to wait for up to ten seconds. Eventually we do the back up, the wait and the recall all chained together with one click and treat at the end and we want to vary the length of the weight each time. We're going to change direction with shoulder to the hand or we could yield shoulder away if you've not yet taught shoulder to the hand. We're just adjusting to make filming easier here. It's not actually part of the routine as such. Just getting ourselves set, set up so number five is lateral movement with the right shoulder in and the horse is working on three tracks. My raised arm brings your hip toward the fence. Click and treat for a good effort. Now we're going to change direction again with shoulder to the hand and do a little bit more lateral work to stretch one side of the body. I like to ask her to come forward a step or two first and then indicate which part I'd like her to bring into the center. So she's got the left hip in and so she's three tracking with the left hip in. That was nice. Click and treat for that. Just asking her to change direction by yielding the shoulder. and getting the rope out of the way because I'm going to ask her to step away from me forward with just a touch on the withers. I think she does about four steps. We can gradually ask for more steps before the woe and the click and treat. Triple treat to tell her it's the end of the routine. <laughs> 